What is up everybody? You know my plan was to start the video out showing you how to how to play Ark. You know the beginnings of it. The trials and tribulations that is Ark. Unfortunately things didn't go as planned. As you can see though we do have a nice little foundation set up. We got a nice little 6x3 base going here. We got some food cooking up. We got a sleeping bag. We have a trike walking on our bait. Really? Really? Seriously? God. Anyway, we got a storage box. Got some goodies in it. Look at that. Got some goodies. And I'm just going to drop that crap. Anyway, we. the plan was to, you know, just start from the beginning. You know, showing you building up, what you got to do. All the fun stuff. But as I said, you know... 30 minutes of me dying over and over again I just don't think makes for an entertaining video so you know I'm gonna show you the clip I'll uh, here just just watch this part right here uh, you know this is the way it rolls this is how we go so we're gonna we're gonna watch the clip real quick and then we'll get back to we'll get back to working on the base and something productive that'll work out So as you can see, we died many times. Well, not just many. We died a buttload of times. Um, yeah, you gotta love compies. These little bastards are just mean, just mean. Oh. So anyway, we're gonna move on past that. We're 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 better people. We, we, we learn. We learn. <laughs> 
That's all we can say. So now we're going to get back to building on this base. You know, I started out in thatch. We we got some wood. We got up to wood building, so we're going to start doing that. It does take a, quite a bit more resources, but you know what? I'd much rather have wood. It looks so much better than the thatch does. I don't know why thatch looks the way it does. Here, we'll make one real quick, and I'll show you how it looks, what happens when you place it down. Now, you will get some of your resources back. That's the beauty of it. Oh, get off those nasty thatch foundations. And it just looks so much more aesthetically pleasing. I mean, seriously, look. Look at that. Doesn't that look so much better? You got your straw. You got what? Straw, wood, straw, wood. Uh, yeah. Need, need not say no more. Alright, so let's get back to this real quick. So, we need to get some clothes on. Just thought about that. We were running around butt, well, not butt naked, but naked. Nuns, to say the least. <sighs> really? And want to guess what? We need fiber. I just love arc. So much fiber together. Now, this is where the fun part comes in. You got your fiber gathering, picking some berries, and slapping things around. And all the while, something's going to creep up behind you, knock you right out. It's going to happen. You, you, you think it won't, but it will. Alright, let's get geared up a little bit. At least we have some armor on. Not much, but at least we got something. Because let me tell you, it doesn't stop too much. But at least it does something. Alright, look at that. We got some shoes on. We are somebody. We are somebody. Alright, let's get back to building. We need some more wood. And we're going to need some more fiber. Let's go ahead and get this fiber taken care of. And go from there. So, you know, playing Ark, it's, it's a lot like life. You wake up in the morning... You think you got your plans made for the day. You know things. You know, you're going to get this done. You're going to get that done. Go to work. Whatever. And then while you're heading into work. Or heading into school. Or heading wherever you're going. You know. Some some jerk slams into you behind. From behind. Wrecks your car. And your day's just shot. Everything you had planned out. All the, all the happy thoughts. And all the good things. Are thrown out the window. Well guess what. That's arc. It's exactly the same. The good thing is, as you get further evolved in the game, it does get a little easier, and it does cut. It does get better. Just not in the beginning. So, <clears throat> what I'm thinking about here is got my six by six. We're gonna get a ton of wood here. And this is where you want to start going up in weight, because you're gonna need to be able to carry a lot of resources. And let's see. We're going to get into. I care about stimulants right now. Cage, hey, sounds interesting, doesn't it? No, we're not going to make a cage. Where's the rest of the wood? There we go. The ceiling's going. Got to have some railings here. Got to have the railings, guys. And then we'll get the sloped corners there. And we're going to need the door frames and the doors. We'll get that next level. Let's go ahead and get us some wood and get this going. It's easier just go ahead and craft it up while you're moving around, make gathering the resources otherwise. If you try to gather it all up, no 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 no. That's not what I want to do. Let's just do this right here. You can hot bar your blueprints here. Look at that. So now what we got to do is just push the down arrow. Look at that. Oh. So much quicker. Down arrow. Look at that. And you'll gain. Once you start getting into craft and stuff, that's the best thing to do. Craft the thatch. Get a bunch of levels while you're crafting it. You get upgraded to wood. Craft and wood. Then you get the stone. Just do the same thing. That's the easiest way to gain levels. 
now on a vanilla server and playing on the actual server though it takes a while to get to these things so the best thing I can say is craft a bunch of cloth hats because that will get you levels pretty quick alright now we can get to the door frame door frame there we go and we'll get to that other stuff later alright back to gathering here buddy I have a sinking suspension. We're going to need fiber. What do you think? Fiber it is? Oh, look at that. Fiber. Oh, I swear. Let's start venturing in the woods to get fiber now. I don't really want to do that. That's kind of scary. So, this is the beautiful thing about this game. So, look bright, glary, dark, shadowy, glary, shadowy, look at this, I mean, what, what about those woods, scream, come investigate, search around here, I mean, seriously, looks like it's from a horror movie, I mean, look at that, we'll go up in here, let's just check this out for a second, because you guys gotta see this, look at this, just walking along. You're, I mean, I feel like Little Red Riding Hood waiting for the big bad wolf to pop out. What was that? Look at that. Oh, look at those. Oh, giant mosquitoes. You know, we do need some kite. Or chite, excuse me. I know I'm going to get ream. I'm going to get ream for mispronunciations. You know, I'm from the south. We don't really give a crap how we pronounce things. Oh, really? Oh, look at that. Oh crap. What's killing me? Compies. If it's compies, I swear to you, just run. Just run. I'm gonna die. Look at that. No. <laughs> I got killed by a giant mosquito. Oh, I swear to you. But look. See? I am prepared this time. You see that sleeping bag? Look at this. Bam. Of course, we don't have any more, though. Or do we? Look at this. I'm a freaking Boy Scout here. Look at that. Look at that. What do you got to say now? What do you got to say? Come on. You know you've got something to say. You know you want to say something. I mean, seriously. After you just watched that little tribute video and you saw how many times I freaking died. Come on. I need props for this one, please. Alright, let's go get our body. Uh, anyway, but notice how I talked about the dark, scary woods. I mean, seriously. Where did I die at, though? Over this. Yes, yeah, this looks evil and scary like it did. Yeah, there's my body right there. I hope they don't attack me while I'm just doing this. When they first. Man, when they first put those things in the game on the PC, it was ridiculous. Because they were aggressive. I mean, they would just start attacking you. Oh god, the glare. Let's get out of these woods. There we go. Look down. Yeah, I mean, literally, they just... I mean, they would just come at you. And even on the even on the PC now, if you attack one of them and you're near them, you'll get swarmed. I mean, on the PC server, I just tamed a, a Argentavis. I think I just got him. They did a server wipe because they had a problem with some stuff breaking some of the mods we ran. Server broke. We started over. And I just got me an Argentavis. I'm way down. Great. Um. Anyway, they, I just got me an Argentavis. Was flying around the swamp trying to level him up to get him a little bit higher level and get some more damage into him. And at the same time, they nerfed the dinosaurs in the game. Which. Oh, really, dude? See, look at that. Just, just investigating me now. The key is to get them before they get close to you. Look at that. Oh, crap. I got him. You're dead. Oh. Anyway. They just did... They nerfed the dinosaurs, so they, they took away some of their hit points and their melee damages. And on Argentavis, it really affected them the worst. So I'm, I'm in the swamp doing this. And next thing you know, I got swarmed by literally 20 giant-ass mosquitoes. There is no coming back from that. You may think there is, but there's no. 
really? You don't go. Yeah, you better run. Oh, look at you. Huh? Oh, what's up? What's up, buddy? You scared? That's right, you little punk. Ah, oh, you can't trust nobody to come around your place nowadays, can you? Let's see a little bit of food here. Oh, got some levels here. And let's get that weight up to about 200. All right. Learn the rest of the wood. I need the fence foundation. And I'm going to go and get the rail. I got the railing. Let's see. That takes nine. Oh, we can get the bow and arrow. Oh, I need to save it for bow and arrow. All right, let's get over here and drop some of these dang berries. Let's fill up our water skins. Probably a good idea. I right, inventory maintenance. Drop, 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 drop. I don't care about you right now. Put our stuff back on. Now we can probably craft a hat. And some gloves. Look at that. We're going to be fully kitted out in our nice little pirate attire. the wood foundation back down there too. Oh look at that, it's raining. Gotta love the rain. Let's go ahead and put this down while we're over here. Let's drop some of this crap off in the chest too. <laughs> I'm gonna save these. This is how many times I've died. I had way more than that because I actually didn't go back for my body on half the time I died. We're not going to need any stones. Let's just put that together. Do a little clean up here. We don't need that. Let's just drop that. I, why did I eat that? I swear to you. They did something because you used to be able to just drop it from your inventory while you're looking in stuff. Alright. We don't need the fiber. Let's just cook up some more meat. Oh, we got meat for days. We'll leave that in there. To spoil. So we're going to need that spoiled meat to make some narcotics so we can start taming some dinos here in a little bit. Right, let's get the rest of our clothes on. Oh, look at that. Stellar. Oh, yeah chick that could literally whoop the crap out of you. How intimidating is that? Apparently not too intimidating to the dinosaurs. Alright, wood. Hatchet. Let's go get some trees. I preferably do not want to go back into the woods. So let's get these. Oh, just ran right past it. Come on. Like a mole trying to take out something. Right. Oh, thought we were going down. Not putting up a fight there, are you? <clears throat> really? Oh. And I need stone to repair my hatchet. Actually, I need flint. Let us get some flint. I cannot wait to get back into metal tools, because golly, these things suck. Just to be out of spite for this. Alright, I know we're probably going to need fiber. No, we're good on fiber for once. I'm really shocked about that. That's one thing about making wood, using wood built foundations and stuff. You don't go through as much fiber as you do with thatch, because it's pretty much just... Oh, hello. I don't think I can tame him yet. Yeah, these guys. Let's see. Oh, yeah. wow. You talk about it all day. That would be so cool to tame him, though, right now. But he's a bear eater, and let me tell you, I'd be chasing him around, putting a bear up his butt every five seconds. And it'd take all day. We might have to do that, though. All right, let's start making some more. I think we're good on foundations. Actually, I think, yeah, that's exactly how many we need those for. And I really want a Gigantopithecus. Those guys are cool. 
they gather fiber for you real good. All right, back to this. Oh, look at that. The remnants of the crappy thatch is gone. All right, now we can get into some other stuff here. So we're gonna need some walls. And we can actually start making some of those. Put that down there. Let's go ahead and level up. And I'm thinking, let's go up and wait. I don't have enough to learn the bow and arc and arrows at the same time, so. And let's just gamma up. Look at that. Let there be light. <laughs> we make a wall. <laughs> That's just awesome. Alright, so I want windows, so I'm going to space this out. Do windows in the center and walls on the outside. Sad thing is, I think I like building in this game more than anything. Oop, wall. Look at that. So cool. Look at these trees over here. Oh, and the rain stopped. Yeah, this is this is just a fun game. I mean, the amount of dinosaurs they've introduced since it's come out is insane. I mean, you got Gigantopithecus, which is a big ape. You got the little little bitty monkeys that throw poop. Those guys are fun. On PvP, on PvP servers, you're supposed to be able to use them to, like, sneak under a gate or something and unlock, like, toss them in a base. And then they'll unlock a gate for you and you can break in to raid somebody. And that's, that's, that's pretty cool. I've never seen it work right, though. But, you know, hey, you're supposed to be able to do it. So, as far as the dinosaurs we're going to get, once we get this base up... And literally just just get the walls and the ceiling up. Hello. We're going to go after a trike. Set. We're going to go after a trike. Oh, that's perfect. Actually. I'm going to put the door here. Window there. Yeah, that'll work. We'll do it that way. And right of walls. Uh, got a level though. Look at that. See, on a, on a regular server, I would still be like level maybe level five at this point. <laughs> That's why I'm doing this on my local game. All right, let's get down here to bow and arrow. So when I first started playing this game, I thought, oh, you gotta have narco arrows, you gotta get the narco, you gotta get the arrows before you start taming dinosaurs. And realistically, you don't. We, I mean, matter of fact, you know what? We need a pet. We need to have some fun here. What do you think? You guys up for some, some pet action? A little hot pet action? Come on, you know you are. Let's see, we don't put that up. Let's be cute about this. So you have two ways when you first start playing the games. Now you're not going to be able to punch out a trike or a, or a car or carbonotis or whatever the turtles. I mean, you can, you're welcome to try by all means. I mean, I, I'll commend you if you do it. I think I actually watched somebody start playing Ark when it first came out in June, and he kept punching everything out, and it worked though. It was kind of funny, ironically enough. But since the updates and everything, you cannot just walk up to a dino and punch the thing. So we're going to need some stones for this. So let's do this. Let's just move the wall over here. Okay, let's put our nice little slingshot right there. Oh, no. Let's put it right next to the spear. Let's get us some stones. Let's put that charcoal up. That's just eating up weight right there. Uh, the fun part is getting into guns and things like that. Let's just clean a lot of this crap up. Alright, I think we're good. We just need to get some rocks. And guess what? Plenty of rocks. 
All right, that should be good. And look at that. We've got a slingshot. Look at that. Oh, really? It's pathetic. Oh, it's a level 120. Oh, yeah, we're definitely going to tame this bad boy. It's going to take a while, but shoot. Look at that. Oh, I killed it. Oh, man. I didn't want to. We're going to have to punch one out. That just hurts. I'm sorry, man. I have to hide. I'm contributing to the cause. There's another one right there. We're just going to punch this one out. I forgot the slingshots do so much damage to a dodo. What level are you, though? Oh, well, this will be faster. And he's out for the count, baby. Look at that. Alright, so what you do to tame him? We're going to throw some berries in there. We're going to throw a couple of narco. Let's throw all of them in there. Oh, wow, look at him. He's already eating. Look at that. Taming up pretty nice. And we're going to get two levels on him. We really wanted that 120. So, you got there's two things you got to do. One, you got to watch their food. And you got to watch their torpor. Now, the torpos are state of consciousness. So periodically, just use, see how you lose that, and this food goes down even faster, too. You should tame up pretty quick, though. This is how you tame, but this is not the best way to tame. Besides, it's just a dodo. The only reason we want a dodo is because we want to get some dodo eggs. Because with dodo eggs, we can get some kit we can make kibble and look you get the dossier look at that we tamed a dodo so what are we gonna name him mm. I got a good name we'll call him Fred <laughs> alright Fred come on we got things to do Come on, dude. Look at him. Look at him. Yeah, you derpy as hell. Alright, now this dude's making me nervous walking so close to the base. Alright. Come on, Fred. Come on. I don't know if you can walk up here. Oh, look at that, he can. Keep walking. And we're going to tell him to say we're following. Oof, that dude's getting close, man. we got to get this base up so he don't decide to go like ape on us. Those dudes get mad. They get mad easy. Alright, back to walls. What do we need? Let's see, we got... We're good on thatch and fiber. We really just need some wood. We're going to open melee damage this time. Melee damage also helps when doing resources too. So we got the wall, let's see. What do we need? Can I do windows yet? No. We might just end up putting walls up for right now until we can get to windows. Because otherwise it's kind of pointless. We really need that. But we'll make, we'll learn the boat. We'll do some boat action in the next video. I haven't really done a lot with the boats, but boats are pretty fun. Want the ramp? We'll go ahead and well, I can't learn that. All right, so we're just gonna keep making walls. So let's get these last bit of walls put up, and we'll be done with the video for the day. Ooh, it's probably a mistake. Okay, good. He's walking away. That we messed up. So let's do a little bit more building here. A 
do a nice little intro for the door. You know, I might just put a door going out to the water. I might build out back this way a little bit too. We'll figure that out. Well, guys, thanks for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed the mass deaths at the beginning of the video. Um, you know, and if you want, leave your favorite comment as to which which death was your most favorite. Was it by the compies, or was it by the compies? Was it by the compies, or was it by the compies? Oh, of course, there was a giant mosquito swarm, or the one that killed me. We'll call it a swarm. As far as anybody else is concerned, who saw that, it was about twenty of them, wasn't it? That's what that's the story I'm going to stick with. Anyway, I hope everybody has a great day, and I'll see you back for the next video.